Hi, my name is Jacob Glanville. I'm the co-founder and chief science officer of a company called Distributed Bio. My science focuses on being able to find people with remarkable immunity and extract from their blood the instructions to make therapeutics out of their antibodies that could help other people. One of the coolest applications of this technology is the work I'm doing with my co-founder, Tim Free on the Mythros Bio project. See, what we're doing is we realize that there's a major problem in antivenom developed to treat snake bites around the world. Current antivenom is a pretty messy technology. They basically milk a snake, take their venom, inject it into a series of sheep. Then they draw the blood from those sheep, extract out the plasma, process it with some enzymes, and then that's what they end up injecting into people. Your immune system responds to the sheep antibodies, so you can't get it the shot more than once. It only works on one snake at a time. Most of those sheep antibodies aren't even against the venom, so it's a low quality product. And it's still too expensive for most of the people in the world who need it. This is the 150,000 people a year that are dying or are permanently injured from snake bite. They're in areas around the equator, areas that don't have the kind of resources to be able to afford an $8,000 vial of antivenom. That's why I was so particularly impressed when I was developing this technologies when I met Tim Friedi. He spent 17 years slowly building up potent antibodies against all manner of lethal snakes from around the world by self-immunization. As a consequence of that, he's also developed a really powerful B-cell immune memory that I can apply my high-throughput next-generation sequencing technologies and robotic antibody discovery technologies to mine through his blood and find those antibodies that can protect other people against those snakes. Teaming up with Tim, we've taken his blood, processed it in my lab into a form of a display library. We've deep sequenced it using genomic sequencers and we're recovering all of his antibodies against those snake venoms that we're going to turn into a permanent, fully human, superior therapeutic that would be cheaper, will work on all snakes, and actually solves this humanitarian crisis forever.